artist LJ fans, today I've got an exclusive behind the scenes footage from the hot show Gossip Girl. That's right, sources told us that they filmed recently at Yale University, so we went down for a peek. We got a look at Chuck, he's just as hot in person as he is on the show, totally. We got to check out real life Hollywood style equipment, and we got a glimpse of the exclusive Yale University campus, home to stylish and elite students like the cast of Gossip Girl. Anna, what? stop lying to the internet. Uh, telling them what we saw. And it's not what, what it was really like, and you know it. For starters, they filmed at Columbia. But nobody needs to know that. It's just part of the fantasy. People who actually want to know what Columbia and Yale are like might want to know. And you know all those students we saw were extras. I am convinced that some of them were real. Oh, explain to me all the Argyle sweater vest then. See? Sweater vest, sweater vest, sweater vest. Voila. Or no, we talked to a real Columbia student. You want to roll that clip? Fine. So um, we're here at Columbia University. Uh, what brings you here today? Here today? I've been here all summer, actually. Wow. I just couldn't leave after school was over. <laughs> I mean, here's someone who likes Columbia so much that she stayed on for the whole summer. And I'm sorry, I don't see a sweater vest on her or on anyone else we saw walking around, OK? You are destroying the fantasy. People who actually like the show just want to imagine how sexy life would be if we were all young high school students in New York. You are a high school student in New York, and aside from those naked MySpace photos, is your life really that sexy? Oh. The show is totally fake. Check it out. They even had a lot of fake trees on the set. Would you stop being such a killjoy? You're just like the media literacy lesson we had at school. I'm not. Every time someone with politics gets sure. their hands on a TV I... show, all they want to do is tell you you shouldn't like TV because it's fake, or it's sexist, or it's violent, or you're a slave to advertising, or what it is. You have never been on a Gossip Girl forum. People there talk about whether the show seems fake all the time. Oh, whatever. I'll read you what people are saying. First he spills about his mom to Dan, and then this whole thing about a club with Vanessa. Chunks are missing, it's confusing. I know, like Chuck Bass would have anything to do with people from Brooklyn, but maybe it's because he can't talk to his real friends. Yeah, if you give a thousand monkeys keyboards, eventually you'll get a forum comment which isn't first post no. or thrown feces. No, they are always talking about whether the storylines and writing are good. And sometimes they are. I mean, check out this clip, you'll love it. Are you Dan Humphrey? Oh my gosh, yeah. Uh, yeah, can I help you? How can you do it? What? I'm sorry, I, I don't... Get back together with Serena? Don't you know she's just gonna lie to you again? She doesn't respect you. She never will. Excuse me, who, who are you? We read about everything on Gossip Girl. Your whole breakup, we're on your side. Except for her. She's a Serena. Okay, um, well, look, this is, this is both creepy and none of your business, so if you could just, uh, go. <laughs> yeah, yeah, see? I mean, it's satire. You're getting so upset and you've never even watched the show. You're just like the parents' television council. Who? The ones in the Gossip Girl ad. You know, they say that the show is mind-numbingly inappropriate. I thought you'd like that. Wait, what? You fell for that? Fell for what? Ooh, the parents don't want me watching the show because there's sex in it. Oh, I'm totally watching it. Advertisers know they can use that <laughs> tactic on you. Uh, that is not why I'm watching it. <laughs> like, the ad campaign isn't helping the Parents Television Council, too. Wait, what do you mean? They've admitted that the publicity Gossip Girl gets them is helpful to them as well. I mean, look at this. This in some ways been good for an organization like you, and is it in some ways good for parents because it gives us an opportunity to talk about some of these issues? In a certain respect, I think it is. You know, if, if every TV show that had content like this wanted to use a quote from the Parents Television Council <laughs> okay. that, that said just You'd how scary God this bless. show is, you know, more power to them. Huh. Well, okay, I guess so. I'm just going to take this to our friends on the internet. Tell us what you think. What is the big deal with Gossip Girls anyway? What do you think? I mean, it's just another show about pretty white people and their problems. Rich white people and their problems. Maybe it has nothing to do with ads. Or how sexy the show is. D did you start watching it because you were interested in the story and the characters? Or because someone told you you shouldn't. You let us know. Okay, bye, internets. Assalamu alaikum. What the heck was that? I just figured it would stir up some controversy. Ugh.